Scene script. Are you aware of the current weather situation in California? It's been quite a roller coaster ride. First off, let's talk about these atmospheric rivers. Picture a massive column of water vapor in the sky, a river in the atmosphere, if you will. These phenomena are responsible for about half of the Golden State's annual rainfall. But recently, they've been more like deluges rather than gentle rain, causing severe flooding and damage, particularly in coastal central California and the Sierra Nevada foothills. Since the onset of this year, these atmospheric rivers have been relentless, one after another, turning the state's weather into a tempest of extremes. They've been so severe that around 8 million people were put under flood watches recently, and that's not all. There have been over 500 landslides since the turn of the year. These storms have not just been a nuisance, they've been deadly. We've lost 19 souls to these storms, and they've inflicted significant damage on homes and infrastructure, Higher elevations too have not been spared, with dangerous snow conditions making travel treacherous. Now, imagine being forced to leave your home due to the imminent threat of a flood. Over 70,000 people have had to do just that, seeking refuge in shelters across 13 counties. And on top of this, over 360,000 residences and businesses are without electricity. So as we look to the horizon, another atmospheric river is swirling into view, ready to unleash more rain on an already saturated state. With the soil soaked and snow melting, the potential for more dangerous flooding looms large. As we brace ourselves for another atmospheric river, it's important to stay informed and prepared. Now, what's next for California's weather? Let's look at the forecast. The Golden State is bracing itself for another atmospheric river. This meteorological phenomenon, often likened to a river in the sky, brings with it a deluge of heavy rain potential flooding, and high winds. The intensity of these atmospheric rivers is such that they can dump an amount of water equivalent to the flow of the Mississippi River. It's no small wonder that they can cause such extensive damage. The areas most at risk are the central California coast and the Sierra Nevada foothills. Here, the soil, already saturated from previous storms coupled with melting snow, could lead to dangerous flooding. Residents should prepare for the potential of power outages, as well as evacuations. It's always best to have a plan of action ready, just in case. Now let's turn our attention to the higher elevations. These areas are not only dealing with the rain, but also significant snowfall. This intense snowfall, combined with strong winds, can create treacherous travel conditions. So, if you're in these areas or planning to travel through them, it's essential to stay updated on the latest weather conditions and advisories. A word of caution to those in Ventura County, Matilia Canyon in particular. Residents here have been urged to evacuate due to the risk of mudslides and blocked roadways. Cleanup efforts in these areas could take several weeks, so it's best to be prepared and stay safe. But it's not all doom and gloom. As with all storms, this too will pass. The atmospheric river is expected to taper off in the coming days. However, Californians should remain vigilant as another atmospheric river is expected to hit the west coast in the following week. In these times of unpredictability, it's crucial to stay informed and prepared. Knowledge is power, after all. By understanding the potential impacts of these atmospheric rivers, we can better prepare and respond to them, minimizing the damage they cause. Remember, a well-prepared community is a resilient one. Stay safe, California. So, what have we learned about the weather situation in California? We've seen how Mother Nature has been throwing one curveball after another, with atmospheric rivers causing heavy rains, flooding, and landslides across the state. In the past few months alone, these weather events have led to the loss of lives and significant damage to homes and infrastructure. The state has already grappled with over 500 landslides since the end of last year, and we've seen the aftermath of these events on our roads, homes, and communities. As we brace ourselves for the next atmospheric river, we're reminded of the importance of staying informed and prepared. The weather forecast predicts heavier rains and potential flooding, especially for Southern California. These forecasts aren't just numbers on a screen, they're critical tools that can help us prepare and protect ourselves and our loved ones. As we look to the future, it's clear that our weather woes aren't over yet. But let's not forget the strength and resilience of the Golden State. As we navigate through these challenging times, let's remember to look out for each other. Stay safe, stay informed, and stay prepared, California.